what it do, Zero Six Crew, it's your boy Zeddy Chunk Chunk, and I am back again with another banger for you guys today. What kind of banger this is? Muck Bang! Merry Christmas, ZCC family. Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night. Now I'm playing with y'all. I know. Um, actually, it's been a couple days since I upload. I know you've seen the hand. Yes, 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 and I know you see the background. I'm back at the crib. Now you probably can't tell because the green screen. I feel like my green screen looks different than my family's green screen, but yeah, it's a lot, it's a lot. My first Christmas alone, but I'll give you a brief story on why that is. But ZCC family, um, let's go ahead and just start this off right with a prayer and a thumbnail. Father God, I want to thank you for this food that we're about to receive in our body. And I ask that you do please bless this food. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let's get a thumbnail. Of course, I'm just happy to show cast. All right. And let's dive in. Today, we're eating Panera Bread, ZCC family. Now that I know this was for, uh, this was my Christmas video, I should have done like some, uh, uh, so that's like a Christmas meal, but I didn't get it, get to it. So uh, this is the flatbread, sausage and pepperoni. This is brand new at Panera. Mm, well, I don't know if it's brand new, but I'm trying to say new. Also got one of their bowls, chicken teriyaki bowl. We got their new mac and cheese grilled sandwich. And then their Chipotle sandwich as well. I am trying to do this all with one hand. And this is hectic. So a flat, flat piece of bread piece of, doesn't come with uh, marinara, I'm assuming. It's good, but it's still hectic. <clears throat> I got the broccoli and cheese soup. And then their mac and cheese. Right there. So, um, yeah, let me first off start off by saying that's extra chipotle sauce. Happy holidays to everybody, man. Happy holidays. I hope everybody's having a, a blessed one, a happy one. Um, you know, you know, if you're alone, I'm here with you. We in this together. I'm at the crib. Um, yeah. This is my first uh, Christmas alone ever in my life. And you guys know how I am, you know. Well, if you don't know, people who do know me for real, um, know that I really am not a emotional person, so it's like whatever. But it's not that there's anything bad or anything. But so pretty much, the story of how I got here is because of my hand, you know. Um, got into an incident where my hand got hurt badly and um, I have to get surgery now. So uh, my surgery, it's either they said I have to, if I do it in Ohio, I have to stay in Ohio longer than I was supposed to stay. Like an extra three weeks. And you guys know I live in Houston. So, um, or I can come to Houston and be in Houston to get my surgery done. But the surgery had to happen right away. I feel like this camera's not even. Could be leaning more to the right. It's hectic. But, um, well, you're left. But, um, so yeah, surgery had to happen right away. It has to happen. Otherwise, um, it could be permanent, like, messed up functions in it. And, um, so I thought it was best that, hey, I come back home and, uh, get this fixed right away. You guys, you know? Um, instead of just doing it in Ohio and be extended and staying in Ohio. Yeah, you know what I mean? So I had to go get this done. But um, I 
I could have stayed in Ohio with, fam with my family and everything, but I needed to get this done, so. And plus, my whole life's out here in Houston. And I, when, I, when it comes to work, I work harder in Houston, to be honest. Because when I'm around my family, I'm just so tempted just to be around them and just do everything that they're doing. Because my family be kicking it. So, I might work harder when I'm in Houston. But um, also, uh, I got a lot of things coming up. A lot of things coming up. Uh, in January and February, so I really need to be in Houston. And it sucks that my hand's in this position that it's in because I really need my hand in this in the coming up future. Um, when it comes to my hand, just my right hand, which is my predominant hand. Mm. So, that's what makes that hectic. Um, when it came to uh, like doing simple things, dude, <laughs> it's crazy. Oh, how much do you use your dominant hand? I'm over here trying to uh, brush my teeth. And it's, I'm just so uncoordinated and it's just like, I feel like a kid. Like you really truly feel like a child learning for the first time when you're using your left hand. When I'm at the doctors, I'm trying to sign my signature. Like the, the hospital ladies, like the secretaries and stuff of that sort, they have to fill out all my forms for me because if I do it, it's not gonna be eligible. Signing my name on things and printing my name is so hectic. It looks like a kindergartner is legit spelling this out like writing this. Nah, I don't even want to say that about a kindergarten because they probably have better handwriting than me. It's like preschooler. <clears throat> it's so hard to... <clears throat> um, showering is a, is a hassle. I do gotta cover this up in the shower and just wipe my whole body down with my hand as though he hectic. There's a lot of things that are hectic that we're not even gonna get into. <clears throat> but um yeah my hand's real swollen right now. Um and I don't feel no pain in my arm. So uh it's like uh the swellingness is like the worst part of it right now. Like I don't, I'm not feeling that much pain. One of my nerves got uh are damaged and uh, the tendons damaged too. So I can't do this with my thumb, you know? So, you know, that's what makes us human, opposable thumbs. So I'm not human no more. But, man, nah, 2021 just had to get his last little boom, one to the chin, you know what I mean? <laughs> Cause y'all know, I tell y'all, 2021 has been a year for me. <laughs> but I'm going to take this to the chair. I'm going to take a push up. <clears throat> but besides that, mm. I hope everybody's having a Merry Christmas. I know I'm enjoying my Christmas. You know? Despite, you know, not being able to be with family and my hand being injured, I'm still enjoying it. Because, you know, I'm just grateful for, um, for life still. Mm -hmm. There's a lot, a lot of craziness that happened 2021 and I'm still here. I'm still alive. I'm still going. I, um, I have a lot to be thankful for. Christmas to me is an extension of Thanksgiving. You know, it's time to reflect and just be happy and thankful. You know, and also to give back. So 
I'm really happy for life. Mm. I promise you guys. <clears throat> I'm not down and out. So, if I'm not down and out, you should not be down and out. You know, as well when it comes to myself. Because I know a lot of you people care about me and, and, and love me and support me. And I truly, truly appreciate that and love that. But I want people to say, like, oh, Dalvin gets spinning with his family and he's home alone. And it's cool. Like, I'm not tripping at all. Like, if I'm not sad about it, if I'm not, like, really, like, moping and, like, you know, it's my first. It's not like, oh, it's my first Christmas alone. Uh, so I'm, I'm keeping, keeping it pushing it and moving and grooving. And that, plus, I got so, so much, so many exciting things happening in my life coming up in the future. And um, everything happens for a reason. Big firm believer on that. And, you know, new things have came in my life that we're going to actually talk about um, soon. And, um, yeah. So, I'm, I'm pushing it, y'all. I'm pushing it. Let me go ahead and try this. Uh, this mac and cheese. I think this is new, too. Is that broccoli cheddar mac and cheese. It's real hot. Mm. So it's pretty much like their broccoli cheddar soup, but with mac and cheese added, <laughs> and not as soupy. But it's good. <laughs> They're putting their ingredients together to make the maximum profit. <laughs> it's really they added their mac and they got their mac and cheese already. They decided, hey, let's add it to this soup and make a whole new, new product. <laughs> They're having a ball. Merry Christmas! <laughs> I was okay thinking about getting a Santa beard and all that. I'm like, nah, I'd be doing a lot. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. So they got me on a whole bunch of pills. I was taking some antibiotics and pain pills. The antibiotics, they want me to take them four times a day. The pain pills, they want me taking twice a day. The antibiotics taking four times a day is really hard. So, <clears throat> um, the new doctor I saw, I went to see like three doctors because it's been so hectic. Like I was in Ohio, like went to the ER room to go get it, go get this taken care of. And then they gave me stitches. I got 27 stitches, you guys. I hope you guys can hear me and I hope my audio is working perfectly fine. Uh, I hope there's no hecticness. But, um. If this, if my audio is not working, this will be an ASMR video because <laughs> I did all, bought all this is about fifty some dollars. This will be an ASMR video right now. I'm telling you right now. As you see, think I'm talking. I mean, you'll see my mouth moving, but you won't hear nothing. Well, this won't even be ASMR because you won't hear nothing. So this will be for visual, visual ASMR. <laughs> but, um, that sound is really good to put that sauce. Even though know, probably better than tomato sauce. <laughs> um, yeah, take them four pills a day. I mean, I don't have a problem swallowing pills. It's just remembering <laughs> to take it. But um, yeah, I saw a whole bunch of doctors. I went to the ER and then I went to some other place, and they're like, "Okay, well, we can get you a surgery tomorrow, but you need to stay here in Ohio longer than expected." I'm like, oh, that sounds hectic. Can't do that. Took a first flight. To Houston, I seen this doctor. And now we're officially got a surgery date, so that's good. And um, even today, I had a, even on Christmas Day, I had to go in and get an MRI done on my hand, and I got to and I had to go get a COVID test done today. So, um, but my new doctor, he uh, said that uh, he put me on some stronger antibiotics. I only got to take twice a day, which is great. Only twice a day. So that's much easier. And I'm not supposed to be taking my those pain pills because I have to have surgery. No. I'm thinking they're about to numb this and call it a day. Mm -mm. Uh, when they do the surgery, they put me to sleep. So when I heard that, I'm like really shocked. 
I'm worried kind of because I'm going to sleep. That's kind of hectic. Well, I'm like, because you're being forced to be put to sleep. One thing I'm have, well, you know, NyQuil does it. NyQuil puts me to sleep and it's forcing me to go to sleep. Melatonin can do it, you know. So, maybe not think too much into it. But that's just like the, the worst part I think of it is like, I'm about to be put under anesthesia. But surprisingly, this doesn't hurt as bad as I thought it was gonna be. I, I don't feel the worst of it is the swelling to me. But um, actually, I got this wrapped three times already. This wrapping is not as good as I had it the second time. So I feel like the way he wrapped it low key is putting pressure on some parts and it's kind of painful. But um, yeah, the second time it was wrapped, it was wrapped the best. But I'm really not feeling pain for real. So that's great. I appreciate that. You know? I wanna know what uh, everybody's doing for Christmas. Hmm? You guys spend time together watching Christmas movies? Did you open your presents yet? Did you just take time to get back? You know, what are you doing for Christmas? Let me know how your Christmas is going. And what will be a great Christmas present from you guys to me? You guys know what I'm going to say. Go ahead. Actually, just give this video a thumbs up. You know, you got to subscribe. Spam this video with a like, a thumbs up. That'll be a great Christmas present to me. I would love that. You know, all, every time when I ask you guys for a presents, all my presents are free. One hundred percent free. When it takes one click or one tap. <clears throat> but I have been um, I lost a few pounds ever since this guest got injured. You know how I lost weight during during COVID too. Um. The two things that are similar is I'm like, I'm down and out, not like mentally, emotionally, but physically I'm down and out and I lay in bed all day. It's crazy part is I've been doing the same thing since my hand. I know he's like, well, you don't need to lay in bed. It's just your right arm. You know, I could be moving and grooving and jigging and, and swooping, but it's like, ah, I'm back. Well, back at the crib, I'm just processing this all, you know. It's gonna come at the worst timing for my arm. But, um, no, I'm losing weight though. It seems like whenever I'm laying in bed, not doing nothing, I lose weight somehow. I, it sounds crazy. But for granted, to, uh, I haven't been eating as much. I, that's really the reason why. But I have not been eating at all, really, here since I've been uh, at this on. And then um, even um, in COVID, I wasn't eating at all, you know? So that's the reason why but still not eating at all but being lazy though because i will eat you know i still do eat so i'm thinking okay well i'm still eating but not as much but i'm still eating and i'm not walking around to burn it off of course i'll walk around the house a little bit but i'm not really active like moving around moving and grooving like as if i were with my family and we're doing all these activities throughout the day you know you know hey that's a good thing this is a uh, a holiday where I'm not getting getting big because I ain't gonna lie when I'm with my family my family loves to eat and they go out to eat a lot and uh, when they do I'm always eating with them and the thing is I'll go out to eat with them and be full but realize I haven't been grinding really so I have to eat another time to do a video but they love to go out to eat a lot my family because you know my mom can put it down her metabolism crazy so yeah I'm always eating crazy there so this is a holiday where I got to save save myself from gaining pounds, you know? Plus I got so much stuff going on in the future where I'm going to have to be active, you know? And we'll be getting into details all about those things soon, ZCC family. But, um, I don't know. I'm not that hungry. This will 90% chance be my first and only meal today. And it's actually not that late though, you know? I got to it, got to it a little earlier. It's, uh, 
536, so I probably started this at what, like 515, you know? Um, let's try this teriyaki though before we get up out of here. I think that these bowls too are new. I'm not sure, I don't go to Panera that much, but is that new, I do apologize. You gotta see how good I am with the one hand though. Hey, yeah, I say do. You know what this reminded me of? Um, what is it? Uh, what's that movie? Love Don't Cost a Thing. When Steve Harvey's showing Nick Cannon, his son in the movie, how to go ahead and take the, the thing off. You guys know what I'm talking about? The condom off. I don't got the magic touch. This is hectic. I'm trying to take, push this out. But no, yeah, that, was, that scene was hilarious. That movie was hilarious. I love the movie. Let's go ahead and try this out, ZCC family. The cherry, bro broccoli, and cherry yaki bowl. I think this is a good addition to their menu, but not gonna cap to you. The cherry yaki is a little dry. The broccoli is good. But you guys know I love broccoli. The rice is there. I think they got these little seed things that bring flavor too. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to know teriyaki. I wanted these seed things like it's teriyaki flavor. That'll probably excuse the dryness of the teriyaki because you know teriyaki it's teriyaki because of all that sauce that we on it. I don't know. Could just be aesthetics. But well, it's definitely a good addition to the menu. I forgot my drink, ZCC family. Mm. This is what happens when I start operating by myself and um, don't plan out everything. I've been. I feel like lately I've been m missing drinks a lot lately, and. Um, yeah, forgot my drink. My mouth is dry. Then it's like, I was gonna say, then it's on the dog. Doesn't make sense. <laughs> but yeah, now I'm about to eat this because this is bringing a little bit of moistness. I need some moistness to my mouth right now. Mm. But now I'm about to eat this dry meat. <laughs> it's not done dry at all. Y'all. It's moist, you know, but every time I have teriyaki, it's usually wet. <laughs> Stop thinking like that. <laughs> this is actually really good. It's just I can't eat that much because it's a lot of bread. And this flat bread, I didn't know it was a whole, like, pizza. I thought it was going to be like two slices. I wonder why this bill came out to the 50 nifty United States of the 13 original column. <laughs> Yeah, no, I wonder the reason why it's uh, the 50 nifty for this. Hmm. No, truly though, I wish everybody a Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. I promise I'm gonna be back for a new year. Um, you know, it was nice to, one of my homies called me. He thought I was still in Ohio. He was asking me to, you know, do something, uh, asking for a favor. That was, he wanted me to do something in Ohio. Uh, now I'm back in uh, Texas. I'm like, oh man, what what happened? Why is that? And told him, you know, I injured my hand. And he's like, oh man, I'm sorry to hear that. Well, if you uh, it sucks that you can't be with your family. If you want to be, if you want to come to a Christmas dinner with us, um, slide through. So I really appreciate that. And my homie, his name is Jariah. You guys, if you guys, uh, he's actually on YouTube too, and you guys probably know him. His channel is called The Bells Plus Two with him and Ming. So they invited me to their Christmas dinner, so I'm excited for that. Probably go ahead and slide through to that. Shout out to the Ryan man for looking out. You know, I probably won't eat nothing though. I'll probably just do it just to be around some some friends, good company, and stuff of that sort. Get me in good spirits before I go to surgery day. You know. But um, yeah. Shout out to your Ryan man. Go go to one of his last video and say hey. Shout out to you for you know inviting ZCC to the Christmas dinner, appreciate that. It's called the Bells Plus Two, Uriah and Ming. Um, 
But ZCC family, I wish you guys a happy holidays. I know I keep repeating myself. It's because I just don't want to leave you guys. I don't want to let you go. It's Christmas. I don't want to let you go. And I ain't doing nothing. All right. I'm just letting you I might as well chop it up with y'all. But I'm not even hungry. But I 100% need something to drink right now. 100% need something to drink. But um, I'm still in good spirits, though. Like I said, don't be sad about it. Like, I'm great. I mean, you know, um, I'm Frosted Flakes. You know what I mean? Um, moving and grooving. The only thing I'm most worried about is anesthesia. But I'm, I really could be tripping. Like I said, NyQuil does it to us, puts us to sleep. So I shouldn't be tripping about no anesthesia. I was actually talking to a friend of mine and they were saying like, uh, like after you wake up, you feel super tired. But what's hectic is she told, uh, told me you felt nauseous. I'm like, oh, it's hectic. Nauseous is one of my worst feelings. I hate feeling nauseous with a passion. I hate feeling like I gotta roll it up, you know what I mean? So I hate that feeling. So I hope I don't feel that. But um, and then and, and then also they said uh, that they were uh, it took them like after they woke up it took them like thirty minutes to really be up. Like they kept closing their eyes and opening them, closing their eyes. I'm like oh, so that's why I probably need someone to pick me up um, from the hospital that day. And I hope that after the surgery, like I need everybody to pray for a fast healing. I, I that would be a great present as well. You know, um, a thumbs up on this video and pray for extremely fast healing. I just can't be out of commission with this, with this hand, you know. You really realize how I feel clumsy without this hand. Not falling clumsy, just just clumsy with everything. With writing and opening and eating. I've been eating noodles. I'm actually looking low-key professional now. I don't know, maybe because my hand is higher, but... I mean, eating noodles and stuff, and I just looks, it feels so clumsy. It just feels not right. <laughs> Brushing my teeth is really what <laughs> it's hectic. When I'm doing it with my left hand, I'm trying to balance the stuff on the spoon, make sure it doesn't fall, and get it to my mouth before something falls. Like, mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Try it. If y'all want to, mm -hmm. you know what? This is a challenge. No, I'm fine, y'all. Let me say, eating a whole mukbang with your non-dominant hand. <laughs> well, that's not the challenge, not at all. If I want to feel how well, I'm feeling, I'm pretty sure everybody, a lot of people went through this, you know, um, where they broken an arm or something like that and broken a hand or fractured a hand and they got to use the, the one that's not prominent. It would have been so much better if it happened. I'm not saying I wanted it to happen, but if it happened on this arm, I'm going to have a ball still. I'm going to be kicking it. Would have been kicking it, but his hand got me out of commission. But um, yeah, um, yeah. Try brushing your teeth with your off hand. Let me know how it goes. Let me know how, to, and then try to sign your name and print your name with your left hand. Just let me know how it goes. <laughs> you don't feel crazy. But this is family. We're really going to end it off. Merry Christmas to all you guys. I love you all. Leave me in the comment section down below what happened on your Christmas day. And if you're spending alone, hey, you're not alone because you're with your boy ZCC. And we all in this together. And we know who we are. We're our stars. We are ZCC family. Make sure you follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, YouTube, Twitter, and TikTok. All is at each other. That is Z A D D Y C H U K C H U K. But ZCC family. As we all know, the grind never stops until the ZCC gang is on top. Let's get it! Merry Christmas. Stay rocking this for those who stay watching for when my tape dropping long as the bass.